Good morning, you guys. Happy Thursday. Oh my god, today is gonna be full of adventure. So I'm so sorry for the way I look. I'm about to go get a haircut and I cannot wait because we are going to a pride event today. We got invited by Ardell Beauty for their ball, their pride ball. And I'm so excited because this is the first Ardell beauty event that I get invited to. Well, no, I got invited to one last time, but I wasn't able to go because, you know, I'm a corporate girl, so I wasn't able to go. But this time I am, I'm actually gonna call off from work because I'm like, bitch, I have to be there. Anytime you get a chance to call off from work, do it, bitch. These corporate jobs do not care about you. All they're gonna do when you leave is replace you. So enjoy your time off, enjoy your sick time hours, enjoy your vacation hours, bitch, because we only live one life. I'm gonna try to vlog my whole day so you guys can see what goes on behind the scenes or in this case, in my life when I'm gonna, like how I prepare myself for an, an event, what I do, I kinda do a lot. I'm gonna take you guys with me on this journey I literally just woke up like five minutes ago, so I'm a little like morodo and shit. So come along with me on this exciting day. Alrighty guys, so I am on my way to cut my hair, bitch, because I fucking need it. But um, we are on my way to my barber's Manny's house. He lives near USC. If you guys need a haircut and live in South Central LA or honestly anywhere in LA, just drive to him. He will leave you fresh as fuck. But um, yeah, I'm on my way and I cannot wait because bitch, it's been almost three weeks that I have not cut my hair. Three weeks, can you guys believe that? I usually cut my hair like every single week. Why? Because I do content every week. But lately, honestly, these past weeks, I've been feeling very like, not discouraged, but I wanna say like not creative. Um, sorry for this little hair that's standing up, but. I'm gonna cut it right now. Um, but yeah, I've been feeling very like, I don't know, very like not motivated to do content. So I'm just like, I need to get a haircut now ASAP. And then I'm gonna come back to life. But oh my God, you guys, I'm so excited because I think I'm gonna change my beard style. And I think I wanna try my beard very, very like low, like when it's barely growing. But then the mustache, I kind of want it to pop out a little bit more. So, and then I want to try the like goatee style where it's just this part, this part, and like the mustache. But I don't know. I want to have a nice <coughs> jaw, which I currently don't. But one day I'm going to get fillers and bitch, prepare to be sick of me. <laughs> okay, you guys, I just got to my barber's house and oh my God, I'm nervous because I don't... I really want to change my beard style, but then at the same time, it's like, bitch, I'm scared because I've never had another beard style besides just a beard. And I'm like shaking, but I'll be back. Maybe by the time I start recording, I'm going to have a different beard. I'll see you guys in a bit. Oh my God, you guys, I am back home. And bitch, I ended up switching my beard style. Are you guys ready for this? beard reveal uh -huh. i feel like okay let me show you guys <laughs> i love it i feel like i i feel like a mature man i feel like a changed man i feel like a senor i feel like i'm like gonna accept my 30 soon and i love it what do you guys think <laughs> i love it i love my mustache and yeah, I've always wanted to switch my beard style, but bitch, uh, I get so scared because one, I do content, so I'm always on fucking camera. Two, I fucking work full time, so it's like, if I look fucking dumb, I'm gonna have to look dumb for a whole week because I go to work. And three, like, it's just scary, but then at the end of the day, my beard grows back in like two days. I cut it short this time, and yeah, what do you guys think? Let me know down in the comments. I really, really love it. Now, for later, I need to see how I'm gonna look with a full face, bitch. <gasps> what if I look dumb? Oh well, it's gonna, it's gonna grow back to regular. But if it grows on me, then I'm gonna leave it like this for a, for a cool while because it's something new, something different. What do you guys think about the hair? Fresh as fuck. I love it. 
But now since I'm home, I'm honestly gonna go to the gym because I started going to the gym not recently i've been going to the gym for a while now but i've been staying consistent for the past like five months and i'm seeing progress slow progress because i'm already older than the first time i worked out the first time i worked out i saw progress in like five months this time i feel like it's gonna take more because i mean that was like five years ago i'm literally 27 now and ya no estoy ya no soy un niño un chamaco I'm gonna change for the gym and then I'm gonna try to take you guys with me. This is the first time I'm vlogging, so I might not vlog at the gym with my camera. I'll switch it to my phone. But once I'm not shy, bitch, you guys are coming everywhere with me. But cut me some slack. <laughs> okay, you guys, so this is my gym outfit. This is by ASOS. This is by Gymshark. These are my boyfriends. Shh, do not tell him. And then, yeah. This is my outfit, and then that's Lilo right there. Oh, the Lilo girl. She's still sleeping on our blanket. Yeah, the Lilo girl is so cute. <laughs> She's such a lazy girl. But yeah, I'm ready for the gym. Today's gonna be my arm day, so bitch, we need to get this pump and <laughs> my little muscles under. But yeah, I'm gonna head to the gym, and I'll be right back. Oh my God, you guys, I just got back from the gym. I just showered. I'm ready to beat this face up for the event. What time is it right now? It is 2.47. 2.47. The event, I think it starts at 7.30. I need to double check the invitation. But I usually take like three hours to get ready just because, I don't know, I like to beat my face, especially with a fresh cut. Everything looks sucked up, snatched, everything. Um, but I'm not sure what kind of look I'm gonna go for. I know it's a pride event, so I'm probably gonna redo the eye look that I posted on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow my Instagram, follow it at It's Me Chris. All of my social media is at It's Me Chris. But yeah, um, I'm gonna show you guys my little content room. I don't think I've ever showed you guys. Um, this is my little content room right over here. It's a mess right now. Well, the table's a mess because I just condensed a lot of things. So this is literally all new makeup right here. So I think I'm gonna do a separate YouTube video with just using all of this new makeup, like Huda Beauty, MAC, literally everything. Um, what else? This is my little wardrobe with like outfits I have. These gloves are sickening. I love them so much. They're by Namelia. And yeah. I'm gonna show you guys my process here and there. If you guys want a full on YouTube tutorial on how I beat my face, let me know down below. I have been sitting here for the past, I wanna say three hours just doing my makeup. I'm almost done. What do you guys think? I am obsessed with this look. It's an inspo from this look, but this time since it's like graffiti vibes, this is the dress code 80s graffiti vibes. I went with like paint splatter if you guys see. Oh my god, I am obsessed. I cannot wait to finish, see all my makeup, and be done. I still need a change. I'm so excited. I just saw that they're gonna have mocktails and cocktails, bitch. I've been trying to stay sober because, I don't know, sometimes I feel like... Like, I'm done being, like, pendejito vibes when I'm drunk, you know? Like, I like to be aware, and when I get drunk, sometimes I black out. I don't even know how I black out. I don't even know how sometimes I get home with my boyfriend. Because sometimes we're like, we both blacked out. How do we get home, babes? <laughs> but yeah, I need to retouch my blush. This is the one size cheek clapper. So bomb. Literally, a little bit goes a long, long way. Just look at that. Oh, so bomb. I am obsessed. Patrick Star, you ate this up. And yeah, I'm so excited to have you guys with me today. I'm going with my boyfriend, so he's gonna be vlogging for me because I still need to shoot content on my phone. So I'm gonna try to vlog everything. So for today's event, it's a Ardell's Creators Ball Party and it's in collab with Reach LA. Reach LA is an LGBTQ organization. You know those um, organizations that just um, help you be prepped? They do like HIV testing, give out condoms, all that, like, um, so I'm excited to be a part of that. 
Um, I've never been to a ball, so I'm really excited because if you've watched Pose on HBO, bitch, you know it's gonna be sickening. Is it on HBO or Hulu? I don't know, one of those platforms, but Pose is a must watch show because it was so good. I'm gonna bronze up a little bit using the Scott Barnes palette. So fucking bomb. You're probably like, bitch, you're already bronzing, but I saw there's a category for face and bitch. What if they're like, do you want to walk the face category, bitch? I don't know what I would do. <laughs> I'm shy. If you guys have met me, you guys know that I'm motherfucking shy. Like, I get in my head when I talk to people or I get in my head when I go to these creator events because I don't know, like it's different seeing creators online and then talking to them in person. I don't know, I, I don't, it's not that I get intimidated. I get in my head because at some point I'm like, what if they're bored of this conversation? Like, what if like they don't think that I'm fun in person, but I'm fun online? And all of these thoughts go in my head to the point where I'm like, I feel like I get awkward about things because I'm like, I'm talking to you, but in my head, I'm like, oh my God, what, do, what am I going to say next? Like, what do I do? Like, I hope they don't find me boring. I hope they don't find me awkward. Like, I don't know. There's a lot of things going in my head when I'm talking to someone in person. So then I feel like that makes me be super awkward. And then I just end up being like, oh, okay, it was nice seeing you. And then I leave because I'm like, eh, that was too much. <laughs> but let me finish this glam and I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, so this is the final look. I'm about to leave to the event. What do you guys think? I am obsessed with this look. So the top is from Salt Murphy. The bottoms are from Shop Akira. My shoes are from the warehouse shoe sale babes. <laughs> and the glasses are, so quick story about these glasses. I have some exact same ones, but the ones I have are Balenciaga and those fucking broke from the nose part. So I have these backup ones from Sheen that look exactly like the Balenciaga ones. And these were only $3, babes. But other than that, look at the glam. I am obsessed with it. The eyes are so fire, look at that. So for today's dress code, the vibe is 80s graffiti crunch. So I went with this because I mean, every symbol is kind of like spray paint, you know, when taggers are spray painting and whatever. So I did that and then while the glam, I don't know how I feel about the mustache with the full glam. I kind of feel like a dad that got glammed up. <laughs> but I mean, I love it. The chain is from ASOS. Everyone loves this chain. Whenever I wear it, they're like, where did you get that? I'm like ASOS babes. It kind of looks like something ASOS wouldn't sell, but they did a long time ago and I fucking got it. Um, and yeah, the body is bodying. I love it. I wish I had some pasties cause girl, I feel naked. But other than that, let's go see my boyfriend's outfit. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna show you guys my boyfriend's outfit cause he's coming with me to this event. Wow, I'm loving the shirt. I'm loving the pants. Okay, so. The top is from Sheen. The bottoms are from Sheen too. The shoes are from ASOS. I love these shoes because look you guys, they're literally like um, moon shoes. They're, they're so big. And then yeah, he can't talk right now because he's um, whitening his teeth with a white strip. And then Lilo's over here being nosy. Hi Lilo. <laughs> I don't think she's ever seen the camera so she's like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> but you guys, it is around, what time is it? It's 6.29, it's about to be 6.30. We need to leave already because the event is at seven. Okay, we're about to leave right now, so I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. I'm so excited. Deli. Period, period. 
also have an open bar and we already have like one drink. So we're just waiting for the ball to start. I'm so excited to see the houses perform. This is what I want. Soft pussy. Soft climb. Soft pussy. This is what I want. Give me to the, give me, give me, give me that climb. Give me to the, give me that, give me that climb. Give me to the, give me that, give me that climb. Soft pussy climb. Oh my god, you guys, we are finally home from the event. I literally forgot that I was vlogging and I just came in and took everything off because I was like, I'm tired. I want to go to sleep. <laughs> but the event was so much fun. Oh my god, that was the first time we ever went to a ball and it was exciting. What do you think? It was good overall. I think it was just a great experience. Definitely a kiki. We'll do it again. Yes, I definitely want to do it again and bitch, oh my god, I didn't tell you guys but there was a category for what? what was it face? Face. And the girl sitting next to my boyfriend was like, you better go and I was like, I've never done this and she's like, me neither, let's go and she fucking pulled me and I fucking walked that category and I did the first round but the sec I literally did not know what to do, my heart was pounding so hard, I was so scared. Alrighty guys, so that is the final part of the vlog. How did you guys like this little mini vlog? I kind of liked it, but honestly, it's like one of the first times that I start vlogging. So I need to remember to like literally vlog whatever I'm doing because there were parts where I was like, oh my god, I forgot to vlog. <laughs> Porque me distraía. But anyways, make sure you like this video, comment down below. Um, what you want to see next and subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys later and also make sure you guys follow my social media at it's me Chris I'll see you guys later. Bye